turkey roasting? Check. You, uh, you sure your mom is okay with you not going home for the holiday? Oh, yeah. I told her how excited I was to experience my first fairy bounty banquet in Big Apple City. A small, delicious celebration. Ugh. Uh, and Praline, um, do we have any extra space for the banquet? Uh, how much space are we talking about? Oh, just my friends and also their entire families. Did you invite their entire family, Strawberry? Well, I want every berry there. Me familia es tu familia. Maybe? There's not enough space. There's not enough time. There's not enough food. It's impossible. Did you just say impossible? Yes. There is no way we can do this. I'll just, I'll text them. I'll tell them I made a mistake and ruined every berries, you know. Time. Impossible is what the women in our family are all about. Impossible's my jam. We've got our work cut out for us. When things go wrong, then we adjust. If it's tough, don't get stressed. That's when we're at our best. And if your world feels like it's crashing down, we'll turn it back around. We'll turn it back around. If life knocks you down, knocks you down, you get back up. If it knocks you down, knocks you down, you get seem impossible but trust me we're unstoppable the two of us won't ever fall get out of our way together we are number one turn problems into something fun before you know it will be done we're saving the day don't ever think that you're going under we never give up very show them that thunder and if your world feels like it's crashing down Amazing, fabulous, shockingly efficient. Yeah, we really are. Not to mention lucky. <laughs> you were saying? It's the Berry Bounty Banquet, and I accidentally invited my Berry Besties' entire families, but it was fine because Aunt Praline and I made it work, but then this lucky spoon caused a chain reaction that destroyed the apartment, and my friends and their families are all outside, and everything is ruined! You are not lucky, spoon. You are bad. Shortcake! Me? Okay, fine, I'll go. Hi, every Berry! <laughs> <laughs> What's up? What's up? We're here for the banquet. Everything all right? <laughs> Hold that thought. Uh, Orange, is your friend okay? I don't really know. We can do this! Give me two minutes and duct it! <laughs> yep, she's lost it. <laughs> Fluffy Chiffon! 
One of Lime's dance? I hear you have some interesting flavors in that fabulous ice cream cart of yours. Oh, uh, weird flavors that make no uh, sense. Mudge, everything Bagel is doing it again. Make him stop. Did Blueberry just get mad? <laughs> hey, now, it's like I always say to my little lemon zest, there's always a positive way to express feelings. Lemon's dad talks about feelings? Ugh, lemon zest. What, like you don't get embarrassed by your family? <sighs> Shortcakes, let us in. It is getting weird out here. It's getting weird in here, too. We have a blowtorch. <laughs> What's up? Shortcakes? Spill. Spill? <laughs> what, do you, what do you mean, spill? Spill what? My spoon destroyed the apartment and ruined the food, and I think the pressure broke my hand, and it's all my fault the banquet's ruined! <laughs> <laughs> Why is every fairy laughing? Holidays never go the way you expect. Oh, I could tell you stories, sweetie. Remember when Lam wanted to stay up and fell asleep in her mashed potatoes? She woke up with a potato mustache. Dad! A situation like this is a good character builder. The lesson we have to take away from this... Lessons later, babe. I'm hungry. Just show us what we can do. <laughs> this is amazing. Oh, I, I'm sorry. Make this lady some comedy, oh, yeah. please. tried to hide everything. We're family. We fix our problems together. I can't believe it worked out. I knew it would. Uh-huh. What? Lucky spoon. If it wasn't for the lucky spoon, none of this would have happened. And isn't this kind of perfect? Oh. Yeah, it really kind of is. <laughs> Sorry, I doubted you. is for smoothest smoothie. Most protein-packed smoothie. Ooh, tootiest, fruitiest smoothie. Every berry cleared up pretty quickly for that one. Woo, woo! Wow, Orange, that is a lot of trophies. But not all of them. I've won every trophy at the Splendidly Scrumptious Smoothie Competition except one. Most creative smoothie. Huh, how come? I like structure, rules, goals. Creativity is just making stuff up. How can you win at that? Why are you looking at me like that? Orange needs a crash course in creativity. I mean, if only we knew the perfect berry to help her out. <laughs> wink, wink. <laughs> uh, you sure about this, Shortcakes? Blueberry's the most creative berry we know. She can totally teach you. Right, Blueberry? The first rule of creativity is... There are no rules! <laughs> uh-uh. Oh, just give her a chance. Yeah, give her a chance. Who are we talking about? Meet the fruit. Feel the fruit. Taste the fruit. No! The fruit. None of this makes any sense. <laughs> That's kind of pretty. You're getting it. <laughs> 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 you really did help bring out orange.
Orange's creative side. Orange's inner artist could always sing. I just turned up the volume. Ooh, uh, how high did you turn it up? Berries, stop your blending. <laughs> Way to go. Great job. What do we think? Does his face say, wow, this is so creative? Well... Uh, oh, it tastes like juicy socks. Maybe? It's okay, Orange. Most artists don't get the respect they deserve until they're dead. <clears throat> Before we declare a winner, we have an announcement. The judges decided to create an entirely new category for one of this year's more unique entries. So, the award for Worst Smoothie goes to Orange Blossom. Worst Smoothie? Created just for me? This is way better than most creative! My own category! Who's the best to be in the worst? This man right here! Hi I guess that's the thing about creativity. It's not about being the best. But I am the best at being the worst! <laughs> it's about being you. Exactly! Art is a journey. Eh, just go with it. Presenting my world-famous Choco Mint Pie! I just need to clip some leaves from my mint on the roof. Yeah, that mint grew fast. If it isn't carefully tended to, it can run over anything in its path. I can take care of that easy peasy. With what, clippers? Uh, something like that. <laughs> the Incinerate 5000. I'll go get it. Have you seen Lemon use that thing? Wait up, Lemon. Let me help you. <laughs> Yeah, I don't see this ending well. There are less destructive ways to take care of an overgrown plant. Clint would never forgive himself if anything happened to his friends. Clint, who's Clint? The mint. You know I speak plant. I think I speak for all plants when I say plants can't speak. According to Farmer Fig's latest guide to gardening, the first thing we need to do is trim the vines. Wait! You can't cut his vines now! Clint's playing rock, paper, scissors! Great move! Another W for the Clintster! <laughs> yes, Gerald, I know a piece of paper wouldn't beat a rock in real life. This guy. Mm. Farmer Fig says spraying a solution of salt, soap, and vinegar will tame unwanted plant growth. Clint, old chum, I'm here for you. Tell this berry what we should do. Whoa, you're trying to make Clint sad. Soap, salt, and vinegar smells real bad. Mm. Clint says I should go on tour. Oh, what a charmer. We'll never get this done if Blueberry shoots down every idea. Then maybe ask her what she thinks. She thinks she speaks plant. We don't always need to agree with our friends. Just listen to them. Blueberry, what do you think we should do? It's not about me. Let's ask Clint. Just so you know, Farmer Fig says that if we dig the mint roots up, we can... Move, move it into, into its, its own, own pot! pot. <gasps> Did you just agree with Farmer Fig? No. Clint agreed with Farmer Fig. He also said he'd be most comfortable if you did the digging line. He trusts you. You're really smart. Clint. Bye, Clint. I still don't believe that plants can talk. But it was nice of you to say I was smart. Thank you, Clint. <gasps> oh. And done. Here you go. Thanks, Thanks strawberry. strawberry. <laughs> All right. It's incinerate time. <laughs> Actually, blueberry and lime work 
together to take care of the mint. But I saved you some pie. Let's do this! Horn, pull! <laughs> well, I meant for you to eat that. I love the smell of burnt pie in the morning. Anybody else done? Uh. <laughs> it's fitting we're here at the Cuban Time Museum of Modern Art. Let's see how our bakers did. I love Fight of the City. Kiki Key Lime goes all over Big Apple City finding the best bakers. Could there be a more perfect show for me? As these cupcakes show, today's contestants proved a great baker needs to be a great artist as well. Yes, exactly. <laughs> you so get me, Kiki. Do you have what it takes to be the very best in baking? Oh, I do. Then I can't wait to come to your neighborhood and take a bite of the city. <sighs> Hello, is there a baker in there? Yes, Kiki Key Lime, there really is. Behind you, actually. I'm just so happy that you're there. And it's just you're my favorite person. And I love you lots. I get that a lot. Hi, I'm in a rush to my next shoot, but I do need a quick bite. What have you got? Okay, okay, I can do this. I can totally do this. Don't freak out. Just take a deep breath. <gasps> Today, I am serving Lady Fingers. My cranberry jam taught me how to... Oh, I love Lady Fingers. But I'm wondering if you could add some organic hand-pressed key lime juice. And you know what I love? A hint of Costa Rican coffee where the beans have been sung to. They just have that extra oomph, you know? Also, could you throw on just a dollop of mascarpone cheese? If you can't, it's totally fine. But if you can, that would be more fine. Just need to grab some ingredients. It should take me. I have two minutes and 36 seconds. Custard, you're in charge. Orange, tell me you have key limes, please. Nope, just regular limes today. Can you juice it for me? Sure thing. Uh-uh, hand juice it, please. Okay. You're the best, I owe you a cake. Sometimes it's easier not to ask. Lemon, lime! Do you have Costa Rican beans that have been sung to? Why would I sing to coffee beans? There's no time for crazy questions! Seriously, who sings to beans? Every berry knows you read to them. Um, it was the best of beans. It was the worst of beans. No time! Lemon, beans! Oh, fuck! The best things in life. That'll do it! I owe you all five! That was weird, right? <laughs> Blueberry! No need. The universe has spoken. Mascarpone ice cream awaits. But how did you... Shh. You must go. I owe you some cookies. <laughs> Constructed tiramisu, delicious. That hit the spot. Extraordinary berry, huh? I'll remember that. Bye. Did you hear that, Custard? She'll remember that we did it. Now we can just relax and bask in the glow of this fantastic moment. Ahem. <laughs> Aren't you forgetting something? Pies. That something is pies. Right after I bake those thank you desserts. <laughs> <laughs> no, 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 I can't be sick. There's no time. I need 500 cupcakes for Sweetie Pie Preschool's annual bake sale, baked and ready by five o'clock today. <laughs> oh. Sorry. Wow, you look terrible. You should really go rest. I can't. I need to get these cupcakes done. It's for the kids. <gasps> How about we help with the baking? Every berry needs some berries sometimes, shortcakes. I don't know if that's the best. Huh? <laughs> <sighs> <sighs> oh. Okay, fine. Orange, you're gonna weigh out 
some dry ingredients here. Lemon, you stand here and combine the wet ingredients, and then we're gonna pass it to Blueberry. Wow, you really captured my aura. Uh, don't worry. We got this. Okay, okay. I'm gonna go rest to the clubhouse. Text me if you need anything. And don't forget, an extra large egg is better than a regular large egg. All right, girls. Let's make our sweet, but very easily stressed out friend proud. Let's yeah. do this. <gasps> it's like looking in a mirror. Blueberry, focus. Did you hear that? It said my name. Hmm, if I use the best methods from each book, I'll make perfect cupcakes. Butter must be super cold, got it? <gasps> huh? Wait, this says room temperature butter is best. Which is it? Hey! <laughs> <sighs> no recipes, no rules. Just me and Egg Sheeran. Riding. Five cups of sugar? That's unhealthy. How about no cups of sugar? <gasps> And maybe some powdered veggies to add some nutrients. Mm, yum! So healthy. Thanks, Custard, but I am not tired, so... <laughs> so boring. That's it. Never leave home without my super duper piping bag 3000. <sighs> I feel so much better, Custard. You know what? It is so nice to have friends who can be there for you and keep you calm, keep you relaxed, keep you freaking out! What did you do? I'm calling it the unbearable icing of being. Ugh. I never made it past the butter. Oh no, I have to deliver 500 cupcakes uh, now, and nothing is done! Sorry, shortcakes. We tried, but we're just not the bakers you are. But how did this happen? You each did something totally different. You did whatever you wanted without any kind of... Wait a minute. That's it? You guys are geniuses! We are. Is she still hallucinating? your own cupcake stand is a hit. And honestly, I never would have come up with the idea if you all hadn't messed up so badly. Thank you for being such terrible bakers. And for helping when I needed it. Anytime. <gasps> Lemon, no! <laughs> <laughs> I meant to do that. Another great day! I love our jobs! I'm pumped! Who else is pumped? Oh, I'm pooped. By the time I close up, I have no energy left. You need energy? You ask this berry. You, me, tomorrow morning. It's gonna be epic! Do I have a choice? Nope. It's what friends are for. See you bright and early. Um, what did I agree to? I'm all about being the best me I can be. And now I can help Shortcakes be the best she, she can be. What are berry besties for? Where's the butters and croissants? Uh, morning, Shortcakes! It's 4 a.m., which means it's... Time to sleep four more hours. Let's go, go, go! Get dressed and get a move on! This was a mistake. I should have... <laughs> what is all this? Time to work out. So, so let me just get this straight. I tell you I'm exhausted, and your solution is more exhaustion? Huh. Let's go! Yes! Woo. I am not okay. Shortcakes? Oh. I give up. I still have no energy and it's been what, days? Weeks? 20 minutes. What? Orange, thanks for the offer, but exercise is clearly your thing. 
And I think we can both agree that it is definitely not my thing. Uh -huh. I don't get it. Friends are supposed to do things they like together, but she hates working out and I love it. I love fitness the way she loves baking. Oh. Ah! Orange? Why? Come on, I got you. Trust me? Do I have a choice? Huh? What is all this? You'll see. Working out is not your thing, but fitness is important. And since your thing is baking, we're gonna get you stronger doing what you do best. Go! Another! Again! Push it! You got it! Energetic. Orange made a workout just for me! Hey, we should make workouts for each of you. Lime can lift books, Blue Ray can do arts and crafts relay. Lemon, we can squat truck engines! Uh, <laughs> Orange, I think maybe you energized her a little too much. It's the endorphins. Just leave her alone. She'll wind down eventually. Everything is going fantastic at Berry Works. Huckleberry Pie is fitting right in, and even bread pudding is cooled off. You don't have a cart. Nope. I go where the song takes me. <laughs> Thing is, all Berry Works vendors need carts. No cart? No you. Huh. No sad strumming without a cart! <sighs> Bread pudding is correct. Every Berry Working needs a cart. <gasps> That's it! Huck can just work out one of our carts! It's a total win-win. Huck gets to stay, we get the help. Three blue blasts, two green meanies, one orange deluxe. Got that, Huck? Uh... Let's see how you do taking orders. I need a large lemon lime barricade blaster, extra syrup, half ice. You need a small? Large. Extra syrup, half syrup. Half a berry. Half ice. Uh, got it. Right, right, uh, blast the syrup. No! Uh, uh, uh. Maybe help lemon instead? Wrench. Uh, no, no, no. <laughs> Where did the chicken come from? Oh. Inspire us with creative new flavors. Oh, close your eyes. What do you see? I see vanilla. Uh, anything else? Vanilla ice cream. Maybe something more daring? Vanilla ice cream in a cone. <laughs> Mind. Blown. Your energy is simple. You should share it with the world. Just not here. Okay, let's see how you do baking orders. The oven gets hot quickly, so... Make sure you use oven mitts. And... I keep the mitts right... Huh? What is happening? Nothing. It's good that music's my passion. I'm no good at anything else. I'm really, really sorry, Huck. 
No tears, my song will never end Because I have you, my awesome friends Who love my art, with or without a cart <gasps> That's it! Instead of Huck working in our carts, we needed to help him get one of his own. The Huckleberry Pie Varioke Cart! You all did this for me? Wow. Hey, why are you still here? I told you, no cart, no way! And there is nothing that can change... Look, Red, the girls made me my very own Barioke music cart. Barioke? Very, very, so contrary. Shake it up, make it up, look at me if I make it up, or you're gonna whisk me away. This may be the best cupcake recipe in the history of the universe. It's just missing one super special ingredient. <laughs> right, Lucky Spoon? Right you are, Strawberry. And that ingredient is... <gasps> Custard! I dreamed the very best cupcake recipe. It had this perfect ingredient. It was, um... It, it, uh, it, it was the... Hold on, I know this. It... No, I can't remember what it is. Why can't I remember what it is? Come on, Strawberry, it can't be that hard. Think, think, think. Uh, shortcakes? You okay? No! I came up with the cupcake recipe of my dreams in my dreams. But I can't remember the last ingredient. Ooh, I've got just the thing. My Dream Grubber 3000. This baby uses cosmic waves to absorb all of your nighty nighttime thoughts. <laughs> kind of fair. <laughs> eh, it's still in beta testing. This is just like issue 37 of Terrific Tales of Tangerine Smash. Tangerine Smash was trapped in the dream world by her arch enemy, Night Mangle, and couldn't remember how to escape. <gasps> Just like me. How did she remember? Her sidekick, Guava Girl's utility belt, gets them out of any jam. Well, a utility belt isn't gonna help with this mental jam. Ow! Lemon! I'm not wearing the helmet! Why am I getting shocked? Huh, is that a bug? Or a feature? A mystery requires a detective skills. Inspector Sherbet Cones always retraces his steps. What did you do yesterday? I mean, nothing out of the ordinary. I woke up, cleaned my room. <coughs> then I had breakfast. I think it was toast with jam. Ow! Lemon! Oh, this thing is stronger than I thought. What else did you do? Typical day. Hmm. I can help you out. You can? Sure. Follow me. To remember your dream, you need sleep. To sleep, you need to be zen. To be zen, you need to meditate. Uh, uh, um, Strawberry, what are you doing? Seeing if any ingredients jog my memory. Chocolate, peanut butter, jam. Ow! Bean grabber, more like shock maker. Shock maker, huh? You don't happen to have a patent on that, do you? My friends were trying, but they were not helping. Seriously, not helping. If only my lucky spoon could talk, then. <laughs> Top press buns! If I get one more. Wait a second. Gonna help with this mental jam. <laughs> jam. Jam! Ow! Jam! Ow! That's the ingredient! The shocks were from J-A-M! Yes! Lemon's machine worked! Oh, my friends helped after all. Well, they're gonna be the first ones to taste my dream recipe. Ow! Here you go. Try it. You're gonna love it. So, what do you think? Now that's what I call baking it happen. Good job, Strawberry. It's spring cleaning day! A day for berries who are organized, precise, who love making lists. All right, berries, it's not gonna be easy, but I've strategized a path to victory. Your assignments. Oh, that's not so bad. Oh, oh. Before the day is done, the berry works is going to shine. And when we're finished, I have a big surprise for you. 
Surprise! <laughs> You're kind of intense about cleaning, huh? Yeah. I'm going to go mop the high line! Woohoo! Well, cleaning is important, and who doesn't love a surprise? Whoa! This will be fun! This is not fun. We are never going to finish! Never fear, berries! With my Dream Clean 3000, we'll be enjoying that surprise in no time! <laughs> or not. You're not getting done today. Lime will be pretty disappointed if this place doesn't look amazing. Plus, no surprise. <sighs> if only we had an old abandoned office that no berry used where we could stuff everything to deal with later. Then the berry works would be clean, the lime would be happy, and we would get our surprise. Why are you all looking at me? <gasps> Can you see my aura? What color is it? We can stick everything here in Jay Quincy Cupcake's old office! I don't know. We'll still do everything Lime asked. We'll just do it later. Oh, Jay Quincy's ghost says that sounds like a delicious plan. He said that? Uh, maybe we should start moving stuff? Uh... Whoa! You're even better cleaners than I thought! Ready for your surprise? <laughs> Follow me! <laughs> Huh? Um, Lime, where are we going? This is going to be the best surprise ever! Lime! Oh. Wait! No! Oh, ah! <laughs> this is how you cleaned up? <laughs> Red Pudding said if we cleaned out Jay Quincy's office, we could make it our own special hangout spot. Surprise! But I guess you all found another use for it. Wait, Lime! Oh, I feel awful. What should we do? What we should have done in the first place. Come on, berries. Hop. <laughs> Heart! Heart! <laughs> know we messed up and feel awful that we ruined your surprise. So to say we're sorry, we have a surprise for you. Open your eyes. <gasps> oh, M. Drop. Welcome to our brand new Berry Besties Clubhouse. We're, we're sorry. sorry. <gasps> this is amazing. Best apology ever. I love it. Wait. Where did you berries put everything? Uh. <laughs> Ooh, still got it. Pupcake! No! Here, boy! Oh, hey, buddy. Uh, I'm assuming this issue of the terrific tales of Tangerine Smash is yours and not Pupcake's? Pupcake's new game, take my favorite stuff to get chased, not a fan. What are you two doing? Oh, uh, Custard is just helping me train with my lucky spoon by hurling dough at my head when I'm not looking. You country berries do weird stuff with your pets. What? This spoon is lucky. It's been passed down in my family from baker to baker to me. The extraordinary berry would not be as successful without it. You don't believe that, do you? Well, why wouldn't I? Shortcakes. Berries like us are successful because we work hard, not because of a silly old spoon. What's so silly about believing a spoon is magical and lucky and looking out for you and wants the best and loves you for who you are? Really? Listen, Shortcakes. <gasps> My spoon! I need it! Cupcake! No! We'll get your normal not lucky spoon back! You don't know it's not lucky! The more I see, things work for me. I know good luck helped me through. My life is great, just trusting fate. I'm making all my dreams come true. That's not what I see, this is how it should be. Hard work's the very best guarantee. Luck's not a plan and fate not a fan. My dreams come true because of me. But there's more than one way to make all of our dreams come true. So much more than one way. Yeah, there's more than one way to do what we want to do. There's more 
agree. We're both the same down deep inside. Two successful berries so filled with pride. And we don't need to see eye to eye when we're both awesome, you and I. But there's more than one way to make all of our dreams come true. So much more than one way. Yeah, there's more than one way to do what we want to do. There's more, more than one way. We're champions. Here. The spoon didn't. Pupcake did. Strawberry Shortcake, Kiki Key Lime, host of Bite of the City. I know! Yeah! You remember me? Sure! The hard work and berry with the fab truck at the berry works. Yes, hard working. Exactly. I was actually just thinking about where to shoot our next episode. What about the berry works? Yes! Sorry, yes! Wow, that'd be great. I think so too. Gotta run. Catch you later. Bye! Lucky I ran into you. Oh, yeah, it sure was. Lucky? That's just a coincidence. Uh, excuse me? We're looking for extras for the new Tangerine Smash movie. Either of you Tangerine Smash fans? <gasps> me! I love Tangerine Smash! You were saying? No way! And ice cream sculpture of me and puppies parachuting in from the sky. Oh, and Kiki Key Lime has to be there. That's what I want for my Raz birthday spectacular. Got it? Uh, Sounds totally. great. Thanks, Berries. <laughs> I was worried this year's celebration wouldn't meet my usual expectations, but with friends like you, I just know it's going to be the best birthday ever. <laughs> Did you write down what she said? What? Is that a doodle of you and Raspberry wearing crowns and sashes while I'm all alone over there? So we're gonna delve deeper into that later. But for now, what are we gonna do for her birthday? Cupcake candle card. Can't argue with the classics. Mm. Mom, Dad, I know you were worried since you won't be here for my birthday, but my friends are taking care of everything. It's gonna be fantastic. This is raspberry. Raspberry tart. Call me when you get this, bye. What? Birthdays are special. I wouldn't wish a bad birthday on my worst enemy and... And, well, that's raspberry. Wait, you want to throw raspberry tart, the best birthday party ever? Yes. Raspberry wouldn't do that for you. She wouldn't do that for any berry. Sure, raspberry and I aren't exactly friends, but every berry deserves to have the best birthday. Who doesn't love a birthday? You get the cake. The weird blowy thing. You won't stop speeching until we do this, will you? I will not! Huh? Okay. Oh, let's throw a party! Birthday, Barry. I hope you're excited. I am! I have to be honest, I know it was a lot, and I wasn't sure you two would really do all the things I asked for. <laughs> when you say all the things... <gasps> Everything I dreamed of! Right. But, like, we may have missed one or two or... All? No! It's perfect! Huh? <laughs> I cannot believe you two did all this! Uh, um, well, but I... We... Right? They kept telling every berry at the Berry Works how important this birthday was for you. They just wanted you to have the best day ever. 
We did say that! Only the best for you. <sighs> Red and Sour had nothing to do with this party. Why are you letting them take the credit? Because it'll make Raspberry feel good. Just like it makes me feel good that my friends were willing to help me plan this party, even if they didn't want to. It's a good feeling when you know there are berries who will always be there for you, no matter what. A luxurious lime! <laughs> Get rid of that basic bev and try this! The Elderflower Lemon Icy from Peels of Plenty. The best drink cart in Big Apple City. Welcome! Uh, what was that about? Red Pudding's been acting really weird all week. Try these hair ties. They're less black than yours. Welcome! Mm. Here. The history of doorstops? Yeah. Books are your thing. Welcome! You have to up your frame game. Red, my glasses have a really strong prescription. <laughs> Welcome! I think he's trying to be nice. That's even scarier. I'm getting to the bottom of this. Mm -hmm. Red, <gasps> you're being nice to Lime in a weird snooty way. Why? What do you mean? Look, I know you and the other Mean Berries don't like me. Mean Berries? Seriously? Look, I'm a big Lime Chiffon. She's the only other berry around here with any style. Obviously, since her dad is Fluffy Chiffon, the biggest designer in Big Apple City. You knew that, right? Sure I knew that. Yeah. I did not know that. Well, he just released the Fluffy Chiffon All-Season Multi-Weather Limited Edition Waistcoat. I have the best connections in the city, but I still can't get one. No. Uh. No. Hmm? Yes! <gasps> no. Aww. So, you're using a sweet, smart berry like Lime to get some vest? No! I did some nice stuff for Lime, a berry I could be friends with, so she would be nice and get me a waist coat. You gave her a lemon icy from some other card, a book she won't read, glasses she can't wear, and you insulted her hair ties. Have you seen her hair ties? Maybe Lime would help you if you were just honest. Right! Honestly, tell some Barry who barely knows me that I want a waistcoat her dad designed? Why would she help me? Because that's how friendships work. If you really think you'd like to be friends with Lime, then try being her friend. Trust me, because I am really good at friendship. Uh, hi, Lime. So, what Bev would you recommend? Sure you don't want a drink from Peels O Plenty. Sorry about that. And about the book. Thank you. Listen... Not done. If you like the glasses, I can get your crazy prescription put in, no problem. Oh, that's very... Still not done. Your hair is fab, and the new hair ties would show it off more. But yours aren't blech. Oh, wow. I... Almost there. I did all that so you'd help me get your dad's new waistcoat. But I'm also a big Lime Chiffin. You're just so... you. Then why are you always so... You? I wasn't always a trendsetter. I used to be shy and a tad klutzy. And sometimes it's easier to make fun of other berries before they make fun of you. But some berries said I should try being honest. So, I don't care about the waistcoat, but I would like to get to know you better. Behind you. <laughs> <gasps> my goodness! Are you okay? <laughs> you're... you're... Bread Pudding, this is my dad. Dad Bread Pudding. Oh! Then this is yours. Oh, I'm Gumdrops. Uh, why? I may have overheard your chat with Strawberry. I'd like to get to know you better, too. You're kind of funny when you're not being snooty. But right now, you have a waistcoat to try on. <sighs> Sweetheart, it's on backwards. Oh. <sighs> <sighs> See, Custard? I told you I was good at friendship. Authentic country pie. I love it. Things are going fantastic at the Big Apple Berry Works. Apparently, every berry loves my authentic down home baking. I heard about I heard that it is so. Ooh, look at me! I'm a simple country berry! I make simple pastries for simple people. And I dress too matchy matchy. What? She does. I don't care how she dresses! She is taking all my customers! We need to show this country bumpkin how things work in Big Apple City. Why? We're your neighbors. I'm Raspberry Tart. That's my truck over there. 
Oh, and uh, this is sour grapes. That's your truck? <laughs> oh, and gum drops. <gasps> so pristine. Wow. It is nothing compared to this thing you've got going on. You're the fresh new fairy on the block. Oh, thank you. So, what can I get you, new food truck friend? Strawberry pie? <gasps> Strawberry strudel? Pano strawberry. That's a new one. We'll take everything you've got left. Everything? Eee! Ooh, uh, 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 I sold out. Who did it? Me, I did it. I hope this whole small town country berry thing doesn't get old. What do you mean? Well, this is Big Apple City. You've got to keep things fresh or customers just move on. The country berry bit is cute today, but if it starts to feel stale, it's... Bye-bye, berry. Oh. Shortcakes, what's wrong? I sold out of everything. That's awesome! Awesome today. Tomorrow? Bye-bye, Barry. Hmm. My country Barry bit will get old! Barry's will get tired of my baking! The universe put you here for a reason. Why would you think that? <gasps> Mystery solved. Look! Um, <gasps> Come on down to the Raspberry Supreme for authentic country treats. Yeehaw. No, they did not! Come on, Shortcakes, we're fixing this. Raspberry Tart, what did you do? What? Berries like my authentic treats better than hers. Your treats? Those are my treats! You bought them and stole my whole, uh, my whole vibe! How dare you! Your treats were strawberry. Mine are strawberry and raspberry and have a bow. See, anyone can do country, and the fairies have spoken. Uh, hello, Strawberry Shortcake. You're from the country. Are these authentic? Uh, well, the berry who baked these definitely knew what she was doing. <laughs> Maybe a bit heavy on the raspberry. Mm. Wooey, if y'all like mixing flavors, how about I whip up a batch of my authentic Everberry Country Coffee Cake to give you city berries a real treat? Oh, <laughs> Raspberry made me feel like being myself wasn't enough. But then she tried to steal everything that made me, me. You can try passing my treats off as yours, but there's only one authentic Berryville Baker in Big Apple City, and she's not going anywhere. Bye-bye, mm. <laughs> Berry. Okay, put that there, over here, yes, um, okay. Or here? Oh, I don't know. How are you settling in at the Berry Works? Still a little nervous. Nervous? Me? <laughs> no. <laughs> what, would, what would make you think that? Well, you've moved those same bowls back and forth ten times. I've been here like a minute. Oh. Pre-baking nerves run in the family. Fortunately, I knew just what she needed. Here, this should help. A gift? Woo! And Praley, you didn't have to get me a... A dusty old spoon. Huh. Thanks. This is, uh... What baker doesn't need an extra spoon? Hmm? No berry. No berry has a spoon like this one. It's been passed down in our family from baker to baker, berry to berry. It's special. Lucky. And it'll be your most prized appliance. <laughs> Once you get the hang of it. Ha! <laughs> get the hang of it. It's a Let's begin.
Total truth, Barry. I did think the spoon was kind of weird at first, but holding it makes me feel like generations of bakers have my back while I bake. Check it out. This spoon has definitely upped my game. Mm, mm. Yes, I can hear them now. The family is definitely proud. And now that I've mastered the ways of the spoon, I feel like I can handle whatever the berry works throws at me. Oh, mastered. Oh, that is so cute. Oh, come on. I mean, what else could there possibly be to... Teach me to... Uh, That's enough for today, young berry. It takes a lifetime to truly master the spoon. 